celebrate today and we're here to say thank you as well. Our new STEM zone here includes makerspaces, fab labs, science labs, we have mathematics speci specialists room, you name it. But it's much more than that. It's not just for STEM, it's actually uh, an environment that integrates all subjects into one area. We believe in collaboration, we believe in interdisciplinary learning, and we believe that this new zone here brings it all together. We have transformed an entire building here. Actually, it's an old gym, and we've transformed it into a space where our students can explore STEM subjects, they can nurture their curiosity, and realize their ideas and aspirations. For that, we had to redesign our labs. STEM is a universal language that I consider as important as English, as uh, Dutch, as German, as all the other languages. And if you're not proficient in that language, you will not be able to master the challenges or any challenges that the future might hold for us. Our children need to obtain skills that require them to collaborate, be creative, autonomous, and knowledgeable critical thinkers. Our STEM zone encourages this not only for STEM subjects, but for all subjects and age groups. When you observe how natural learning occurs in the right setup, like here, then you understand as well how important our new STEM zone is not only for STEM, but for the entire pedagogy in our school. AS is a school which is focusing on innovation, empowerment, um, and always want to see what is the best way how we can give education to the kids. STEM is one of these uh, kind of combined areas together with arts and sports where you can see a lot of the kind of holistic approach of learning coming together. And the future of society is built on people who are, have a scientific uh, background and big leaps in society are made through people with a scientific degree, so it's uh, enormously important. I would like to express our sincere gratitude to our main corporate donors, BSF, Dow Chemicals, Atlas Topco, ExxonMobil and Johnson & Johnson. And then we have numerous other corporate and private donors who all contributed to the success of this building. Thank you very much for that. So the idea behind our approach to STEM is that we want a kid to develop ideas and be able to realize these ideas as well. I would like to thank our entire faculty and staff, the students and you parents. You were very patient with us during the construction period. I hope that you see that your patience was, patience was rewarded with this beautiful new space. And it starts right here.